platinum four. Got a ways to go. I tend to brew a bunch of jank, stuff that I don't expect to be particularly good around this time. Um, because losing isn't that detrimental. You can't you can't go beyond uh, platinum four. And so far we're just a hair over five hundred um, with our first two decks. So I think this is a uh, I don't know okay hand. Um, if it didn't have Warren Collects, it would be a all again, but I think we're going to keep this and hope we get the Boron Clex and thereby to some other action. Dean's Tower. It's them most likely on Rafine or uh, Domain. I don't know how this deck is going to perform against either of those. Looking more like Rafine when I see a Dark Slick Scrolls. Yeah, so we're on Rafine Legends. And they just slam Rafine here and attack. Uh, could be bad. Uh, we, we can get to Oren Collects next turn. Deep Cavern Bat um, is a little, uh, really extra annoying because they're going to get Oren Collects, I would imagine. And in so doing, ruin our next turn. Doesn't even put anything in our graveyard. We can fetch out with Scrap Gorger. Okay, we have Anissa Ascended Animist. It's not when we want it. Um, and it is an, a little tempting to play it here for five, make a four four. Um, but we're not going to do that just because I'd like to back it up with Bushwhack and or Timio's safekeeping uh, so I can get the Warren Clex back. So we're going to do nothing. And hope they don't slam Rafine here. Gilbrid, the Apocalypse, also bad. Lucranos is interesting. Six, maybe maybe we wait a hair on I might just bushwhack the cavern bat. I don't know. I don't, I don't know how else to get rid of the cavern bat. It would be nice to get born clex, but we could also save the Bushwhack to fight Shieldred with the Nissa Ascended Animate token next turn. Um, but we would have to draw another Forest for that. Um, in which case, I think I'm going to go ahead and Bushwhack off the Cavern Bat. It is kind of annoying that uh, Denik prevents us from exiling cards from the graveyard. This is a good deck for, for anyone interested in standard brewing. Um, yeah, we're going to safe keep Pelucranos. Yeah, so curiously, we'll, we'll hopefully be able to resolve this here. Yeah. Um, get our forests. Play yet another Scrap Gorger. Pass. Close to the point where we might just be able to win. Um, 7 times 4 is 28. So we got 28 plus our actual power on board. Uh, and they just lost, arguably, uh, five toughness. They're going to go probably to 
see, it'd be 31 if they draw off kicks because they'll lose one. So 31. I still think we probably win, even though the, technically 33, thanks to Denik. Pretty close. But I don't think we block here. If they don't draw a land, which is, I think, what they're looking for, then they probably don't have any play. Ugh. Well, that makes it a little bit harder. We're 11. We would be able to put, let's see. If they remove one, the problem is we are in big trouble. Um, because then we would only have 7 times 3, 21 plus 4. We're not even close. Uh, so alternatively, we, we could play Nissa and plus, risk losing it. Um, I think that's going to be our play. We're going to play Nissa and Plus. Uh, but let's see. Yeah, I guess I'm going to do that first. I hate letting them know ahead of time, but if it's countered, then all of this discussion has been for naught. No counter. Um, they don't have removal. We would just win. But we're going to be a little conservative. Could be wrong. What a bastard for Clux. We have to jump off of the Scrap Gorger, that's okay. Well, Rafine is a little scary. <laughs> I'm really surprised to see the attack not at Nyssa. I guess maybe it doesn't matter a ton. Yeah. We're going for it now. No question about it. I'm not sure if they're quite dead, but I'll have to wipe. See, it's, it's really close. <laughs> I didn't even do the math. We got 30 plus... In this case, definitely dead. We'll take it. 12, yeah, they were dead regardless. 